Hello guys, welcome back to Move As You Cat with SolidWork 3D Modeling Practice Exercise Number Two, and also don't forget to subscribe to our channel here. It will be helpful for us to growing up. In this uh, tutorial, I will create a 3D node. You can see the image here, and you can get this uh, reference image from our site moveasyoucat.com. Okay, we start now. Open your SolidWorks software. First, I will change the units into matrix. You can click uh, here and select the option. Choose the document properties tab and select uh, the units here and change to the millimeter, gram, and seconds. And okay, click a sketch tab here and create a new sketch. I will choose the top plane. And I will create a polygon here from uh, the center point to here. We give a dimension for this uh, circle about 30. Okay, and then I will create a circle in shade here to here. We give a dimension again for this uh, circle about 16. And okay. Next, you can click a feature tab and select uh, the extrude brush. You can extrude uh, the object with uh, distance about 15 and OK. Next, click here to finish. Click uh, front plane here. I will create a line from uh, this point to here and to here and connect to here. You can zoom in and then I will give a uh, dimension for this uh, line object about two point and okay we give a uh, angle for uh, this uh, two lines about 30 degree and okay next we will active uh, temporary access you can click here temporary access you can see the access here and then click uh, feature and select uh, revert cut and for the axis of revolution, you can click uh, this axis and this uh, the result and OK to finish. We will create a thread uh, inside a hole here. You can click uh, here and select the thread. And for the thread location, I will select uh, this uh, edge. Next, you can change the size of the thread here. And then I will increase the and a condition about 20 point okay and next use the cut a thread here i will active a mirror profile and select for the mirror vertical you can see the result here and then click ok to finish okay we create a 3d notes now and then I will change into a isometric views. Can click here and click a isometric. And we will apply material. First, I will active a photo views. You can click here and add inch. Active uh, the photo views and OK. Select the render tools here. And then you can click here appearance. And I will use a metal material can click here and select a chrome material and I will choose a metal chrome here you can click here and drag into part here okay we click a edit scan here I will change the background into colors and change the colors into these colors you can select a keep background here and OK to finish. And next, I will change the lightning into a soft uh, spotlight. You can click here. Next, we click a scan illumination, waiting for uh, rendering passes. And I will choose uh, this uh, image. You can click uh, OK here. And then we try to view windows for a rendering you can click our turn off perspective view and we're waiting for the rendering until the finish you can see the result here okay i think it's enough today for a solid work 3d modeling practice exercise number two how to make a note in a 3d model 
if you have any question you can comment below this video and see you next time in a solid rock 3d modeling practice exercise number three